Jack, is there any way that you might consider going to sleep? <laughs> right, should I take that as a no? Because it is 8.20. It's kind of late. Yeah? So kind of every time I put you down, you kind of get up and hang on those bars. <laughs> yeah, I know, but please, do you think maybe, because mummy's making a curry. Yeah. What do you think? No? Right. All right then, well, thanks for letting me at least sort of ask the question. And I guess we'll just stay here till you uh, decide to uh, go to sleep. That's fine. No worries. Morning guys, it's another Monday morning. The weeks are flying by. It always seems to be Monday morning. Always seems to be another week. Right? The night was okay. He was up at midnight and then at four and then at six. He wakes up and he basically gets upset and I go in and I give him his dummy and then he goes straight back to sleep. So it's kind of, yeah, I don't need to feed him or anything and I wish there was a way that he could find his own dummy and put it in and settle himself. I've tried putting two dummies in. I think I'm going to try putting even more. I'm going to go down. Today we have come out to a park that I've not been to since having Jack. I used to come running here and it's so beautiful. There's a big lake at the bottom. At the moment we're just walking around. Jack just tried his first chip, which is super exciting because I am obsessed with chips and I kind of been holding back. Then I just couldn't really resist and he loved them and he was like gobbling them down. Um, literally couldn't get enough of them. So that has been the highlight of the day so far. He's now having a little sleep. I think I'm going to carry on walking for a bit and then maybe go get a coffee and read the papers. That looks really fun. kind of want to go on it. Anyone else really scared of squirrels? I hate them. They're basically like rats with tails. to come to the cemetery we kind of stumbled across it and it is immense there's lots of famous people buried here as well Karl Marx is buried here that's kind of cool I don't think we're gonna to stay too long because it's a little bit creepy but it is absolutely beautiful we're in a cemetery okay <laughs> We are having a TV dinner, aren't we, Jack? Yeah. We're also uh, having fish, which is doing really well at, and peas. And the peas are going in one pea at a time. Hey, hey, hey. Do you want another pea? Here's another pea. Okay. It's okay. It's Tuesday, and wow, last night was an interesting one. I think Jack was up every hour um, except one but then he was up at 12.58 and then he was up again at two. Um, I think the problem is that he is sleeping a bit too much in the morning now so like yesterday he slept for two and a half hours which is basically him catching up from his lack of night sleep so this morning I'm going to try and let him sleep less which is so hard to do to actually wake him up from a nap. But I can tell that he's just super tired when he wakes up because he's not slept enough in the night. And then he's making up for it in the morning. So maybe if I try and let him sleep less in the morning, he'll sleep more at night. We'll see. It snowed last night. It's the first time you've seen snow. <laughs> Jack, look at this snow. 
<laughs> snow. Try some snow. It's cold. <laughs> Have snow for breakfast, Jack. Jack, look. What have you got there? What have you got in your treasure chest? Show mummy. <laughs> Jack loves a good cardboard box and so do I. Oh, and this is what he thinks of the uh, cupboard locks we've got in place. Yeah. He kind of likes to pull it off and suck that sticky bit underneath. So they've been really successful. You know? <laughs> just gonna stay in and chill and play. I got dressed because someone popped in but Jack I think is gonna firmly stay in his PJs which actually are my fave. Got little planets on them they're really cute. So yeah gonna have just a nice relaxing day and drink tea and maybe watch a bit of telly. Um, yeah. <laughs> in photo albums that have been lying around for years. to meet one of my best friends for dinner. Sam came home early, he's gonna look after Jack and give him his dinner and bath him. And yeah, I'm gonna go drink some wine, have some nice food. I think we're going for a Mexican. And yeah, catch up. basically waiting for Jack to wake up. Um, he's now awake, I can hear him. Let's go in and see. Good morning. How are you, mister? How was your sleep? Did you have nice dreams? Did you dream about milk? Did you dream about Mr. George? Is <laughs> your friend? Can't believe I've been up since 5 a.m. just waiting for him. I've become one of those mums that just wakes up because your body clock is so used to waking up. I think he kind of stirred, and that's what woke me up, and I'm just going to go back to sleep. Anyway, um,. I think it's a day of coffee. I'm just so happy that he slept through the night. Um, now his mummy needs to learn how to do that. Jack is loving peanut butter right now, so it's breakfast and having peanut butter sandwiches. It's all right. I just want him to eat, to be honest. I don't really mind at this stage what it is and when, and it's better than biscuits. We are heading out now, we're going to meet my friend and her baby. Jack is sleeping next door in the buggy in the toilet, that's kind of where he sleeps best. And what I normally do is transfer him straight from the buggy to the car seat, and then hopefully he doesn't wake up and we have a nice smooth ride. I definitely spoke too soon. Jack's not happy. 
We were in a little bit of a rush, so we didn't put on Jack's coat, so instead he's wearing my scarf, which actually looks super cute on him. Slash kind of like a really posh pashmina. Do you like it, Jack? Not doing eye contact, because we're a little bit upset from the car. It's okay. We had a little bit of an accident. I held the thing up and all the fish slipped out. Whoops, silly mummy. Yeah, Jack does this thing now where he sticks his tongue out and he starts panting, kind of like a dog. Um, it's very sweet because I think he does it when he's happy. food right now. This is also a china plate. Probably a bad idea. I can't wait till he can talk and answer me back. I feel like he really wants to talk. <laughs> right? <laughs> I am baby free today. Um, oh, My mother-in-law has got Jack because tonight I am having 14 people over for dinner and I'm going to attempt to make a three course meal so um, and canapes and little things to eat after dessert. So yeah, quite a lot to do. As you can see, the kitchen is a massive mess, um, so am I. And yeah, it's just so helpful not having Jack because to be honest, if he were here and scurrying around and needing milk and food and all of that, it would be a lot, oops, it would be a lot more tricky. <laughs> This mess that's absolutely colossal, but I'm just gonna go to bed and forget about it and do it in the morning. Night night. That is the end of this week's vlog, guys. Thank you very, very much for watching. If you enjoyed it, give me a thumbs up or leave me a comment or subscribe. Next week, we have got a really busy one actually. We're going to a couple of exhibitions, gonna see some friends, just generally gonna be out and about quite a lot. So, hope to join you next week. Bye.